Hey guys, welcome back to Mass Effect 2 or Beth. <laughs> Mass Effect 1 actually. It's the second time I've done that. Oh, and then you know when I'm doing Mass Effect 2, I'll say Mass Effect. But anyway, okay, so I was just gonna go to the Admiral Kahoku guy who like I had to finish that one mission by going to talk to him. Then I noticed this guy. Yeah. You you need to see this guy. He's such a jackass. Ten hut That is. Rear Admiral Mihailovic, 5th Fleet. Hi, asshole. We weren't told to expect you, sir. I would have prepared a formal greeting. Spare me the pleasantries. I command the 63rd Scout Flotilla. You and the Normandy were slated for my unit after shakedown. And the Council got their paws, claws, tentacles, whatever. They got them on our ship and you. I still serve the Alliance, sir. As a Spectre, I can advance our interests to the Council. You still know what color your blood is, Shepard? I don't begrudge the politician's decision to throw you to the council. It's an opportunity. I do begrudge this over-designed piece of tin, though. <laughs> the Normandy is a fine ship, sir. She's served us well so far. It's a gimmick, Commander. Useless in a stand-up fight. This experiment diverted billions from our appropriations bills. For the same price, we could have had a heavy cruiser. But no, we had to make nice to the Turians, throw money in a co-developed boondoggle. I'm here to make an inspection, Commander. Normandy is an Alliance warship. I intend to see she's up to snuff. We'd be honored to show her to you, Admiral. I'll just bet. Wait here, I won't be long. Commander, I'm not happy. Okay, I gotta go renegade on this jacket. Sounds like a fairly common situation. Commander, I suggest you secure your mouth. It's going to get you in trouble. Who designed that CIC? Putting the commander aft of everyone else is inefficient. What if he needs to discuss with the operators toward the bow? Modified Turian style. They prefer commanders looking over their subordinates rather than in the middle of them. We wanted to see how effectively they can command with that setup. Hmm. Reasonable goal, but they should have studied that in a lab rather than on a frontline warship. I had to shake my head at that drive core of yours. 120 billion credits of element zero to make this thing able to move without giving itself away. You realize we could make drive cores for 12,000 fighters with that money? What good is it to hide for a few hours anyway? Useless. Oh my god, just when he starts to sound somewhat reasonable and then he has to go and start bitching again. We can loiter in an enemy system and monitor traffic, or drop infiltration teams on enemy worlds. Normandy could be more effective than the Solarian STG. Maybe, maybe. But that's not the job of a proper warship. <sighs> We're supposed to find and kill the enemy fleet, not count how many times their garrison goes to the bathroom. And we need to talk about your crew, Commander. Oh. Krogan? Asari? Torians? What are you thinking, Commander? You can't allow alien nationals free access to Alliance oh. equipment. Oh, you are not insulting Garrus. Oh, no, you're not. See, I kind of wish I could say that. <laughs> Between Saren and the Geth, we have enough enemies out here. Treating other species with suspicion and distrust won't win hearts and minds. That assumes the hearts and minds are worth winning. That hasn't been proven yet. You have anything else to say, Commander? Any other justifications for the state of this vessel? I think Normandy is a good ship, sir. Even if you disagree, you have to see that her joint construction and multiracial crew make the Alliance look better. Your job is to look good, Commander. The Alliance navies is to win wars. I'm not convinced Normandy isn't a waste of taxpayer money. But I am convinced that you believe otherwise, and that you'll use it to its best ability. I'll be submitting a report to the Joint Military Council. It will not be as negative as I planned. Good hunting, Commander Shepard. Make us proud. I think it's 
Citadel Tower where the Admiral Saren is. Saren was one of the most respected Turians in the galaxy, Garrus. You gonna be okay going up against him? Saren is either a traitor or a madman. Taking him down will restore the good name of Turians everywhere. Just keep saying that. Especially to humans. We've got a lot of angry people right now. You know, I never really got elevator talks in my first playthrough. This is kind of different to get <laughs> elevator conversations. I think I got maybe one in my entire first playthrough. Commander Shepard? Oh god, not her. Kalisa bin seen in Aljalani, Westernland News. Would you answer a few questions for our viewers? What do you want to know? You've been given a unique position to represent our race. People want to get a sense of how you'll do that. Humans have been trying to get the respect of the galactic community for 26 years. With that in mind, what are your feelings on being the first human specter? The specters represent the best of every species in the galaxy. To be asked to join them is an honor. Some have said your appointment is the Citadel throwing humans a bone. Have you encountered any situations where the Citadel asked you to place its needs before the needs of Earth? The Council is concerned with the needs of the whole galactic community. We're part of that community now. Our needs are on their agenda, but we're one of many. You really do believe that, don't you? You've been given command of an advanced human warship for your missions. Is there anything you'd like to say about it? Actually, the Normandy was co-developed by human and Turian engineers. Its design incorporates many innovations, all of which are classified, I'm afraid. So, the Turians have knowledge of the Normandy that is being kept secret from the Alliance public? Do you think it was appropriate to hand Earth's most advanced warship over to the Citadel? <laughs> oh, you bitch. I wasn't aware it had been handed over to anyone. I'm in command, and last I checked, I'm human. Same goes for my crew. Human, yes, but you do work for the Citadel now, Commander. Speaking of your new job, did the Council order you to sabotage human research concern on Novaria? I'm afraid I can't discuss the details of my missions. So you were there on a mission from the Council? That's very interesting. Given your recent experiences, do you think humanity will ever get the respect it deserves from the galactic community? <laughs> Respect's a funny thing. People always assume they deserve it. The truth is, respect is earned. And I firmly believe we can earn it. You're an idealist, Commander, but a sincere one. I hope you're right. One last question, Commander. Rumors back home say you're tracking a rogue specter named Saren. Do you have any comment on that? Wait, I can't even say that? Hold on. It's pretty clear you have an agenda here. I'm not gonna be a part of it. Excuse me. You can't just walk away, Commander. The public has a right to know. Isn't it true you're just a shill for the Council? Oh, <laughs> Okay, yeah, so it's definitely the council, or the whole Citadel Tower, where the Admiral is. But yeah, don't worry. That reporter gets hers. Though not until the second game. <laughs> okay, so the Admiral is over here, yes. No, I'm waiting to... Commander Shepard, isn't it? My name is Admiral Kahoku. Is there something I can do for you? You sent a recon team out into the Artemis Tau Cluster? Yes, that's right. They went missing a few days ago. I've been trying to find out what happened to them, but I keep getting the runaround from Alliance Brass. Do you know something about this, Commander? I'm not sure how to tell you this, Admiral. Your men were killed by a Thresher Maw. A 
Threshamore? That's not... My men wouldn't just stumble into a thresher nest. Not the entire unit. Somebody lured them there with an Alliance Distress Beacon. Placed it perfectly so they'd land right beside the thresher nest. Damn it. I had a bad feeling about this ever since my team disappeared. An Alliance Beacon used as bait, my unit wiped out, and nobody seems to know anything about it. Commander, I appreciate what you did. Now I need to do my part. The families of those Marines deserve to know why they died. Anything you need from me? Not right now, Shepard, but I'll let you know as soon as I find something out. Alright, so there's one side mission done. Um... God, there's so many. Um, okay, I can do Rita's sister while I'm on the Citadel. Alright. We're going to Cora's Den. Oh, and then I'm gonna go to Fux to show you guys something. If I remember. Actually, I'm gonna have to go back to Fux anyway. So, yeah, I will remember, damn it. I will. Okay, sorry for the random pause there. My mom came in and to give me this awesome drink. Not alcoholic, of course. You're not going to be seeing me playing this drunk. Don't worry. Or maybe that's an odd rap. Oh, Caden, you would have a comment about this. Hi, I'll be with you in just a sec. Wait right here. Why do I get the feeling you're not here to order drinks? I need to talk to you about your work with CSAC. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Now, if you don't mind, I need to get back to my customers. This isn't a game, Jenna. These people are dangerous. Now you sound like my sister. Why is everyone so concerned about me? I can take care of myself. I need to go. I'm not a stripper. I don't get paid to stand around and look pretty. Lovely girl. Yeah, I agree, Kate. She's quite lovely. Alright, now what does the journal say? Go talk to what's her face, right? Go talk to Rita. Alright, but first, we're gonna run into someone else. Spoiler alert. <laughs> What did you just say? Push off. I never did nothing to you. Damn newcomers. Think they can run the place. <laughs> what was that about? I guess we better go find out. Alright. But first, we're going to flux. It's gonna be entirely random what I do at this stop, but I just, before I forget, you guys just need to see it. I guess the way that I'm talking about it makes it sound like something so amazingly awesome. No, it's not amazingly awesome, but it's kind of silly and fun y ish. He just wants me to cheat it. 
what you call it. More rumors about strange metal creatures with but, okay. Oh, this is gonna make even sillier. Okay. Yes, but there's more. Yeah, there always is. Okay. I heard they had some connection. Oh, how the hell do you dance again? <laughs> no, they've totally spoiled it because they can't remember how to dance. And dancing oh. down below, gambling up above. Good place to blow off some steam. Well, I feel stupid. Where the hell is the Why can't I dance? Okay, well, the stupid, silly, random thing I was going to show you is that you can, like, dance with whoever you're loving. Oh, whoa, hey, I uh, didn't mean to put that, but... Oh, you just hit E. That's it, seriously. Okay, well, that works, too. Wow, did you see that she's, like, dancing initially? That was really weird. There, see. Oh. <laughs> she's all shaking her ass. <laughs> and Garrus is all standing on the side, all dejected, like, oh, I wouldn't do it. Don't worry, Garrus. Don't you worry. Give it two more years. Okay. Back on track now. We're gonna have to go to CSEC. Ran wrong thing. Ward CSEC. <laughs> I feel so stupid. I thought there was like an actual like highlight. Okay. Now then. I'm gonna go here. You know, you'd think that, like, you might get, like, an extra dialogue or something from Garrus about that. But. Nope. Detective Chellick, come into my office. I want to discuss this in private. No offense, Commander, but what the hell were you thinking? I don't follow you. You could have blown Jenna's cover. We were just getting information, Chellick. I gathered that. It might seem cold letting her take all the risk, but we're keeping a close eye on her. Do you really need to risk her life to get the information you want? This job isn't easy, and it's usually unpleasant. I'll 